All right, I've got the iPad 7 and then I've got the uh, iPad Pro. This is 12.9 inch. Obviously, it's quite a bit bigger. That's the main difference. The other main difference between these you're going to see is on the ability to process the faster speeds. So I've got them both set to about uh, roughly 120 cycles per second. And I'm just going to try and run my hand the same speed on both of these. So here's one and here's another. And it's pretty noticeable that uh, this one can't keep up at that speed. The spacing is quite a bit different. So obviously to compensate for that, you just have to run your, run your hand a little bit slower. And that's how you can match the pattern. However, you know, if that's important, you just got to realize that um, the iPad 7 just doesn't have uh, enough processing power. Uh, at about 8 volts is where they both are pretty identical. I gotta remember that I got two different Apple pencils here. There we go. So on this one, we'll run that, and then this one, we'll run that. And spacing's a little better. My hand speed may have been a little bit off. Um, this one is actually a little smoother than this one. You can see kind of the jaggedness. You gotta kind of dial it in to find out where the best uh, pattern is, and that's just due to how often the processor checks itself um, to measure the speed, and then it checks itself. So it's it's not perfect because the processor is technically neither processor is fast enough, so it's almost doing a simulation. Um, but you can find the ones that'll uh, you know that are a little smoother that work more consistently. But that's the main differences between these two is the size, and after about eight volts. Um, which is roughly 83 cycles per second. Um, that's about where the iPad 7 maxes out. Whereas the um, iPad Pro, even though it can go up to uh, 15, um, technically I don't think even 15, if I run 12.5, you'll see that it, it 15 isn't even a true representation. Um, that's 12.6 there. Um, we bring that up to 15. Um, they're almost identical. There is a little bit of a difference, but after about, uh, of course, that's 200 cycles per second. Nobody should be running their machines that fast, but, um, looks like a hundred and what is that? 163 cycles per second is, uh, I'd say that's, that's about the max for the iPad Pro.